Hi, welcome back to the island again. I'm just out here. There is a, a boat coming in in the back. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. That's the Hannah Glover. I can't see it on this small screen right now. But uh, yeah, it's in, oh, there it is. Okay, so that's a transport out to that children's island. It's called the children go out there and um, they camp for the day and then they come back at night and they keep um, sailing to and fro and that's their summer regime it's pretty nice but anyway i wanted to discuss um the q show and what most people are looking for i just got contacted the other day by an individual in another country and he was interested in how much training would cost with me and i told him first off i work out of the the Shihan's Dojo. Now I don't own my own dojo. I sold that back in 2006. So almost 20 years ago now and I've been traveling internationally teaching around the world uh, because I couldn't run a good school at the same time as I was uh, teaching overseas. So I also told him there were seminars near him. He changed his location. He said, okay, I live in this country or how about this country? I said, yeah, sure, I'll come. He asked me how much and whatnot. I told him all of that. And then um, he asked me if what kind of certification he would get out of that. And I don't know what people are thinking. If it's your first exposure to Q-Show, what kind of certification do you want? Do you want a um, certificate of participation? I mean, that's kind of useless, basically. But um, if you want certification, uh, it's going to take you some training and some skill. You have to prove skills in the Q-Show to move on to a different level. So I basically told him uh, maybe the first two levels uh, but the first one is the most important. And I also told them all the levels, all 10 uh, training levels and all 10 uh, instructor levels or practitioner levels, as they are called, um, have knockouts embedded in each one. It's the inherent name of the game. You dysfunction the human body by attacking its weaker anatomical structures with great tools, great targets, and great trajectories. So um, I don't know what his reply is going to be after that. I suggested since he only wanted to do the knockouts, he'd be better off just learning online rather than sponsoring a seminar as it would be a lot more cost efficient. Uh, so again, when people are looking into this, they have all different kinds of desires and wishes and wants, but most of it is centered around doing knockouts. And there is so much more be beyond Q Show than just knockouts. All right, there's um, the healing aspects that are just incredible. There's intimacy aspects. There's oh, so many things that are reaching into our daily lives. Because let's face it, we are human. We are anatomical structures. So your anatomy uh, and your physiology wanders through this life. You might as well understand it a little bit more. Now, when you study the dysfunctions, you also understand a little bit more of the functions, okay, and how to rectify some difficulties and um, heal some issues in your own body and others. And our health and wellness program has been uh, adopted uh, around the world, again, in about 45 countries. We have licensed um, instructors of it. As a matter of fact, in September, I'm going to Switzerland to work a private Kyusho um, healing seminar and a public Kyusho healing seminar uh, testing as well. And then we'll do one day of uh, martial as they want to develop the hands, which are invaluable also in the healing aspects. So again, what you need to find out of the Q show, you can find online your direction. And then once you've figured it out for yourself and figured out if you want to train Q show and want to really understand Q show inside and out, not just the knockouts, then you can seek the uh, hands-on training uh, via uh, a seminar at first to break the ice uh, and then finding a local uh, instructor or working with yourself and friends to become a study group leader and developing the skills to one day become an instructor. So um, that's it for today's uh, post. Hope you're enjoying your summer. You take care.